Hey there, it's Jake here. So you're struggling with a blacklisted IMEI or a bad ESN on your device, huh? I've seen many services out there claiming to fix this, and sure, most of them might do the job. But here's the reality. Some methods can be tricky, expensive, and unsafe for your device. However, I've got some great news for you. There's a safer, quicker, and best of all, free alternative that does wonders, and it works on any device, be it iOS, Android, or any device that uses SIM cards. I'm about to show you multiple ways to remove a blacklisted IMEI from your device that are not only effective, but also risk-free. So stick around, and let's dive right in. Quick heads up, folks. This video is only for those who truly own their device and just can't remember their login details. We're here to help you, not to assist anyone in doing anything shady like unlocking stolen devices. Let's keep it legal and respect each other's rights. As always, we follow YouTube's standards and guidelines. Now let's get back to the action. Ready to dive deeper into the world of device unlocking and blacklist removal? No worries, there's no hard sell here. Just some friendly pointers to get you on the right track. First up, let's chat about ESN Doctor. They're pretty much the go-to guys for getting your device off the blacklist. They are super reliable, and they know their stuff. It's like having your own personal team of tech wizards tackling your device's tricky issues. Then you've got Safe Unlocks. These folks are all about making device unlocking a breeze. With them, you're not just another customer. You're a friend they're eager to help. Looking to switch service providers or boost your device's resale value? They've got your back. But wait, there's one more tool you've got to know about. Unlock here's AI-powered unlocking web app. It's like having a smart tech assistant right at your fingertips. No need to sweat the small stuff. The AI takes care of all the complex parts for you. Stick around because we're about to crack open the secrets of how to use Unlock. Here's AI Unlocking Assistant. Your device has no idea about the freedom it's about to get. Before we proceed, there's something you ought to know. These unlocking services generally operate best in first world countries. If for any reason you find yourself unable to access these services or prefer not to use them, we've got some good news for you. Every week, we're giving away 250 unlocks to our video watchers. Yes, you heard that right. All you need to do is like this video, hit the subscribe button, and leave a comment with your phone model, for example, a Samsung S9, along with your IMEI and the country you're in. That's it. Once you've done these steps, you're automatically in the race for this week's unlocks. Remember, it's super important to be precise with your phone model, your IMEI, and your country in the comments. Great, let's jump straight into it. Get started by pulling up your favorite browser on your phone or computer. Type in unlockhere.com into the address bar, and before you know it, you'll land on the official AI unlocking website for lifting the IMEI blacklist. Nifty, your AI assistant, is ready to help. Scroll down just a tad and you'll see several options. For now, let's tap on Fix IMEI Blacklist. Now comes the fun part, interacting with the app. Begin by selecting your device brand. Don't worry, it's compatible with all major and even medium-sized brands. Picked yours? Great, now hit the next button. Next, you'll need to pop in your device's IMEI or serial number. Don't sweat it, there's a handy tutorial right in the app. Just head over to your phone's dialer and press asterisk number sign 06 number sign. A pop-up will appear with all your device's info, including the IMEI. To wrap up your application, you'll need to share some contact info, just your name and email address. And while you're at it, make sure you're cool with all the terms and conditions. Need more info? Feel free to dig into the resources available on the platform. Once you've done all of that, sit tight for a bit. In about 5 to 15 minutes, you should get an email with your unlock details. If it doesn't show up in your main inbox, take a quick peek into your spam or promotions folder. To seal the deal on your order, you'll need to copy your verification code and click on Confirm My Order. Paste your code onto the page, complete the CAPTCHA, and wrap it up by clicking on Validate Info and Start Unlock. And that's it, you're done. Nifty will take over and wrap up the unlocking process. Just pop in a compatible SIM card and restart your device. As demonstrated, the IMEI unlock method proves to be highly effective, not only for the Samsung S9, but also for a wide range of devices. You can go ahead and give it a try with confidence, and feel free to inspect your device to ensure everything is running smoothly. If anything trips you up along the way, don't hesitate to chat with live support. They're ready and waiting to help you out. Alright guys, here are some alternative legal ways to get your device off that carrier blacklist. Remember, we're keeping this legit, no shady stuff. One option is to directly contact your carrier. Simple, right? They sometimes have policies to remove devices from the blacklist if certain conditions are met. 
You might need to square off any unpaid balances or finish your contract term, but hey, that might be easier than you think. Another route could be through third-party services like ESN Doctor, Safe Unlocks, or Unlock Here, which do this stuff every day. They're pros at removing devices from carrier blacklists. Just remember that not all services like these are created equal, so do some digging and make sure you pick a reputable one. Keep in mind, folks, the best strategy is prevention. Try to avoid getting blacklisted in the first place by keeping everything on the up and up with your carrier. That's all for today. I hope this video helped you solve your blacklisted device issue. Catch you in the next one.